Yo, yeah, I guess it's true that when they say the few will make it And best believe in that category, I found a placement This was never for the money, you're the payment this was Yo guys, welcome back to another video And you might know that I have a full garage on Forza Horizon 3 So today, we're gonna sell 30 cars Because the limit you can sell at once is 30 for some odd reason So I just decided I'd record it as well so let's go and sell some cars. Okay, so I'm probably going to sell cars I don't really like or I'm not really going to use. I'm one of those people that just keeps their cars, even though there's no point in keeping them. Like that, I won't use that, so we might as well auction that car. How much? We're going to put on for three hours. So we do have 29 cars to go after this. I mean, a limit of 30 cars, it's not that good. It does take a while to list up a car as well. There we go. So what else am I not going to use? Going to keep both of them because that goes 250 mile an hour. Probably we yeah, we can sell that because we've already got an S1 class version of it. Going to put it up for three hours yet again. So there might be a higher chance of someone buying it out, but it really is a shame that you can only have a limit of 550 cars. I mean, I've hit that limit and it is sad. Okay, so stuff like this here. I've got two Audi S1s. Both stock exactly the same. We only need one of those. That will probably only sell for like the minimum. But oh well it's getting rid of a car from the garage. I don't really want to do this. But it's because if I do wheel spin openings I get new cars. And then if I want to buy any more cars then. I'm pretty full up. Now here we've got. Oh my god we've got like 5 RS4s. I'm going to sell this one here. Now, I might sell another one of these as well. I'm not too sure. But I just do like having cars in my garage. And now I can't. Okay, so that RS4 is up. Not going to sell that one. Not going to sell that one. I'm going to keep them. I like RS4s. What can we do here? Sell that one because that's stock, I reckon. Maybe not. I don't know. That will sell for a bit, hopefully. Now, I do want to talk about how much money I will make off this. And I'm looking at about maybe 300k from selling these cars. Now, here, we've got a lot of M4s. I'm going to sell this green one because I don't really like it. I actually did create the design, but now I don't like it. Hopefully, something like that will get bought out. So, that's uh, 51k. Now, this BMW M3, I don't know why I bought it off the auction house. It looks horrible with that paint on the uh, red rims. So, I don't have a clue why I bought it. Maybe because it was a high class. Like, it was S1 class. So, maybe that was why. But, if anybody actually likes that paint job on it, then that's bad. There's my M3 drift build. Very nice. That, that just um, looks confused. Two 1995 M5s. Going to sell one of those because there's no point in having two. Uh, put it down for one hour, actually. Second car I've put on for one hour. The rest are all three hours. Sell that Corvette Z06. Just a stock one. Already got a standard one like that. So uh, three hours. Hopefully someone buys that out. That would be nice. So, yeah. Maybe this is a way of me getting some money and clearing out my garage, which... Is actually what I need to happen. I've got so many cars that I just don't need and probably not even driven and probably won't drive in the end. I've here's got two of them. We'll keep BS1 class one. Auction this one. It's like in wheel spins, I wish it gave you the option to sell it even if you didn't have the car. Because say if you don't have a car and you get it in a wheel spin, you have to take it. It automatically goes to your garage. But if you have have it once and then get it in a wheel spin again, it gives you the option to sell it or not. Sell one of these, got two of them, no point having two. I'm sure it's going quicker now when we get onto the auction thing. I've actually not used an auction house in a while before the last few days. Don't know why, used to always love it, buying cars off it all the time. Camaro IROC Z, 488, sell at least one of these. So yeah, 200 subscribers is very, very close, which is crazy to think. Also in my video saying I got a full garage, that did quite well got quite a lot of views in a short amount of time and yeah people that commented didn't know it was a thing that you could have a full garage and I was like that's, that's good that's why the video is on YouTube because I didn't know that was a thing 550 cars was a maximum you could get but 
obviously it is. Uh, sell this one. Okay, so that's something I didn't know. I've got two Ford Mustang Boss 302 Horizon editions. I actually didn't know that, but that's now nice to know, I guess. Uh, I've got two GMCs, both stock, so we can sell one of them. So yeah, the Toyota Supra is the most expensive, at around 1 to 2 million. And it's kind of bad, because most of them go for like 200k, which is so bad, they're just worth nothing now. Apart from stuff like the Nissan GTR that are, and Lamborghini Huracan that are just not in spins anymore. That, I don't know why they were taken out either. Just don't know why. Okay, so we have reached a maximum number of auctions for this time period. Please t try again later. So if we go to my auctions, should be about 30 cars here now. And there's uh, some stuff. Yeah, so we're selling these for about three hours. And yeah, hopefully that you guys somehow enjoyed this. I'm just trying to make room in my garage for future videos and that. So thank you for watching. Leave a like if you did enjoy. Subscribe if you're following around here for probably daily fours of videos. I, I want to say daily, but at weekends sometimes I don't upload. Like a Saturday, I'll have a day off and sometimes a Sunday. So yeah, subscribe for weekly. No, it's like every day in a week, fours of videos. I don't know what I'm saying now, but yeah, peace out.